welcome to yet another episode of Crossroads, and you're with me, Anit Nalikungi. And as usual, I'm always with these two lovely ladies. Please introduce yourself. I'm Maishi Nana. Yes, thank you. And then in our previous episode, we were talking about safer sex. We're saying that whether you're educated or not educated, everyone has a right to safer sex. And the best we can do is promote safer sex starting from the grassroots. So in today's topic, we're going to be talking about whether it's okay or not okay to have contact with an ex-flame, with an old lover. Is it okay? So, Panish, I'm going to start with you. Like, do, how do you feel about it? Is it okay to still be in contact, like, with your ex? Mm. <laughs> Okay, well, I'll give an example of myself. Uh -huh. um, I have an ex-boyfriend. That you're in contact with? No, no, oh, he's okay. in contact with me. I'm not in contact with him. Okay, but, but then communication is, is, like, is like a two-way thing. That's the thing. I don't talk to him. Uh -huh. Okay, I, I do the highs, how are you, some good and stuff. It's not because, you know, like I hate him or whatever. Okay, I hated him at some point. I didn't want to look at him. Okay. But then, like, now I'm like, in a different zone, I'm doing something different, like mm -hmm. I'm a different person from the girl that he dated. Mm -hmm. So I know at the deepest little part of his heart, he wants to have a piece of this new me. Okay. So sometimes I'm like, wait, won't he take advantage of, because even if I have changed, like I have evolved from whatever, uh -huh. won't he still use me the way he did? He did the last and time. And moreover, mm -hmm. I have moved on. All right. So I don't want him in my life. But in okay, a way, but then when you say moving mm -hmm. on, yeah. have you just moved on because you've bettered yourself or emotionally as well? Because, you know, like some people, they'll be like, oh, you know what? I moved on. I went mm -hmm. to new things. But mm -hmm. then emotionally, they're, they're still in that same old place. The bad part. That's where people commit suicide because they haven't made a proper decision of I'm going to move on from him. I am going to start a new life. Mm -hmm. So sometimes moving on, as, no matter how painful it is, mm -hmm. it is good for you to do it because it's not just you it is your mental state as well and it's not just your mental state it's about the people that you surround yourself with because you become very tense you become loud you become very mm -hmm. aggravated mm -hmm. of the small little little things so mm -hmm. you need to like consider this little yeah okay so my panisha has talked about moving on do you think like moving on is as easy as people make it to look like because people will just be like once you break up with your boyfriend ah, you know mm -hmm. what you're going to move on you're going to forget about it but Let's put you in that situation where you, you just ended a relationship with someone and then your friends be like, oh, why are you going to move on? Do you think like moving on is quite simple as people make it to say? Not that simple anyway. Moving on is not that simple mm. because when you look at the memories and the time you've had with that person, mm -hmm. you can't just get out of it. So it's something that happens for a quite number a of time. times mm -hmm. and that you have to understand yourself that, yes, this happened. Mm -hmm. And I'll have to move on and focus on what will help me grow in my mm. future. I like maybe you focus on things that will not get you anywhere else. So if it's about moving on in life, yes, it's there, but then it's hard. All right. Komano do ababadu atu amabuelandi. This I would say like a quote. Can the sentence? Si komano na zodi adi chibwe si chigata ne gudi si jidani. Mm. Uh, you, you, mm -hmm. you get, you know, like, people will be like, no, I broke up with him, I'm going to stop talking to him, mm -hmm. Jan -jan. it's like, goody, you're trying to say, goody, you're bringing this enmity between you two, mm -hmm. but then people will be like, ah, it's where's the jika, that's that's true. true, to me it's true. Okay, how, how do you take that one? You're saying, goody, it's true, so are you still going to be in contact with your ex? Like, Not being in contact. Wo, wa, 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 wo, you go uh, not being in contact. Uh -huh. uh, you value the relationship between you guys. Okay. Okay, so if you are that close, mm -hmm. Now you have to limit yourself in some things. Mm -hmm. So uh, when I have to say, <laughs> is it right anyway? Okay. Mm -hmm. I will uh -huh. give you straight to the point. Yeah. Mm. You do not have to be in contact with your ex-boyfriend, okay. regardless if and you had okay. sex every day, sex every minute. Mm. He bought you chocolate, he bought you clothes, he bought you okay. this, he bought you that. You Stay don't have away to be in contact him. with him, but then that, uh, you shouldn't be in enmity with him. Okay, 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 yeah, okay. The thing is, mm -hmm. I'll give you like two scenarios, yeah? Mm. One, you loved him so much. Mm -hmm. He hasn't moved on. Okay, no, you haven't moved on, but, but he, he has. has. Now, this is where the drama comes in. I have gone to a couple of clubs, mm -hmm. partying, mm -hmm. and when girls fight, in my color, wouldn't the new girlfriend, the ex-girlfriend, or some other guy? I have seen like girls fight over a guy. Yeah. Now that's the thing that now we're in a okay we're like in a society whereby as my I'm going to manage for 
Pajara mm. mani has adi amuna masugu anu akusowa amuna goje <laughs> pa. What they say, and <laughs> unfortunately, it's just a mentality that keeps a lot of women in a relationship. Okay. And they start acting vile and very, what's the word, demonic in a way. Like this oh, yeah. lady, okay. Ana Mubanga. <laughs> Ana Mubanga Manjai Luja. Okay. Mm. Oh, yes, yes. yes. Mm. Wabu 24, yes. Mm. 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 Korea 24. That was very stupid of them. Because okay. if a guy is cheating on you, mm -hmm. let go of him okay mm -hmm. it's not necessary for you to fight over someone like look at them now what if the guy decides mm -hmm. they will come out of jail and then they'll find out who you the man has married, the man has married. married. which okay. is very stupid and then mm -hmm. it's going to turn into a chain now mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. of which that's not okay i don't think that's that's not how things should that's go. not right. how it was even going the mm -hmm. time mm -hmm. it was like when i watched the the video mm -hmm. it was like she got a lift from this guy mm -hmm. and then a friend of this of the owner of the man mm -hmm. saw her coming out of the car oh, okay. and they assumed story. and no, they assumed stupid assumption the way to <laughs> yes. Yes. and then there was also a rumor that they were, they were drunk they went out together and then they were okay. drunk okay. and unfortunately they, were, they had an accident uh -huh. and then they were found outside everyone was drunk and uh -huh. then it was in the morning that's uh -huh. when her friends now started telling her that your husband is outside with a lady in the car. Oh, oh, oh no, they, they assumed they, they probably spent the night yes. together. Jan -jan it's unfair. Okay, mm -hmm. all right. Now, there are other situations where, let's say, as the girl or the, bo or the, or the girl, mm. the girl or the guy, yeah. mm. you actually feel good. Okay, we're breaking up. Come on, you feel like good. But then, between. yes, like you feel like good. Well, okay, we've left each other. Mm. In a peaceful way. What did that do? Woman and Musa were going to say, Oh, hi, hi, hi. Come on, was also one side is still bitter. Like, in a jidiga, so the one that happened to Kulion Kweja, where the guy actually. I'm not sure, Gudi area, and come on, the guy actually stabbed the woman. Anna Pedra Wuja. How do you do with such situations? Because, why, why, oh, Musa X, why, when I said, you know what, let's say. My boyfriend is James. Then you know what? Nasiya and James in a peaceful way. Commander mm. James is still stuck on me. Is still bitter. He doesn't want to he see me moving on to yeah. yeah. someone else. Mm. How do you deal with such people in the society? Because at the end of the day, whether you like it or not, these people pose like could it be a threat to you? Look at that situation where you're saying uh, Anampanga stabbed. Yes, okay? he stabbed her to death. Actually, uh, that person never accepted that. Zimpismezo is an idea between them. Mm -hmm. He couldn't let it go. Mm -hmm. So Anabe Zogori involved himself into something that was strange. So, so, Eva, so mm -hmm. like demonic, as she said. Okay, conclusion. Okay, wait. Uh -huh. in, in that same situation, because mm -hmm. I read like the articles, Time Ed Mabanga 16 days of mm -hmm. activism against mm -hmm. gender, Anna Iga newspaper. Mm -hmm. And then the article was written by a lady who was related to the deceased. And then Anna Iga Mnyuspaper, I would if the ex takes up the deceased. Would it be the banja janja and the phone number so good? No, I'm always still, we're talking about. Keeping in contact with your ex. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm sorry to say this, but then don't you feel like somehow she she, she contributed to, to the outcome of, she, of the situation? That was a trap. And that's where you need to be careful with conducting with your exes. Because you don't know what your family. ex is going to do to you. You never know. Day. What if he was, uh, he was, he is a pedophile. Okay. Uh -huh. there's, a, there's another word for it, not pedophile. We call them... Um, Psychopath. Okay. He's a psychopath. Mm -hmm. He might be black, but he's a psychopath. Okay. So you, you, <laughs> it's only white people that. I, I, I didn't say that. I didn't say that. But that, that's just being a psychopath. Yeah. Now, what if this girl had a, a daughter, mm -hmm. and then she was married, mm -hmm. and then she has because she, 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 she was she, she, she was she having moved a house. At that point, she uh -huh. had moved on, and she was in a relationship with some other man. Mm -hmm. Now, what if she was married, and then he decides to light the house on fire? 